Good morning. Welcome Team Southside, where teamwork makes the dream work. Mr. Reynolds here. And Miss D. And we have some fabulous third graders we've grabbed today. We've got... Maylee Brim from Miss Dow's class. Cannon Lester from Mr. Schellen's class. All right, and you will see just why we have them momentarily. But for now, let's go ahead and stand up and say the pledge together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and liberty and justice for all. All right, great job, you guys. So, you know we have our estimistry going this week. And our estimistry, your job, has been to figure out how many dominoes are inside of this cup. So we've gotten some pretty good clues so far. So, Maylee, what was one of our clues for our estimistry? It is not less than 15. Excellent job. So remember, we've got those not clues that can be kind of tricky if you're not paying attention, but we know it is not less than 15. And, Cannon, what was another one? It is not, what, I'm sorry, it is not an even, an odd number. Good job. It's so, not, tricky not questions. Not an odd number. Not an odd number. Okay, and we have a brand new clue for you today. It also is not more than the value of three dimes. Ooh, okay. So some math should be going on in your mind right now. First thing you should be thinking is, hmm, how much is a dime worth? What is the amount of one dime? And then you have to think, what is the amount of three dimes? And if you do your math correctly, that's gonna give you some pretty good guidelines to narrow down your estimate. So of course, tomorrow we will officially reveal, so keep working hard and see if you guys can figure it out. Okay, well we have these kids here with us today because they have come up with a really cool idea for third graders here at Southside. So you guys tell me, what is this idea that you came up with? A, a third grade, grade book, book club. club. Third grade book club. And how did this idea come about, Maylee? Um, we started talking about it in wellness. Mm -hmm. We walked around the bus loop and th thought about all the books we love and how we love to read and how we wanted to share that with everybody else. I love it. So mm -hmm. you two share the love of reading. I do too. I love to read. So you guys got to talking about how you have that in common and then you want to share that love with other people. So you guys thought to create your very own third grade book club at Southside. So Canon, if you will hold this for us. So this is the flyer that was created for the book club for third grade. And Maylee, if you would tell them, what does that flyer say? It says we will meet once a month in the morning from 7.20 to 7.50, join and read chapter books and discuss them in fun ways. I love it. So you guys decided that once a month in the mornings for third graders, if you sign up, you can join the book club and in the mornings we will discuss books, we'll answer questions, read together. It is going to be so much fun. Cannon, anything else you want to add that we haven't talked about yet? Can I have a question for you? Oh, so yeah. How can other people get involved? What do they need to do so that we know that they want to participate? I think they need to either ask you or Mr. Reynolds if they want to sign up or... Yeah, so we have sign-up sheets like that one. That's right. And they're in, in the third grade, grade hallway. hallway. Yep. Yes. So if this is something, if you are really interested in reading, you love to read chapter books and you love to discuss them with your friends, this is right up your alley. So make sure third graders, you sign up and write your name and your teacher's name and we will be in touch very soon about this kicking off. But this is all of their idea which makes us super excited because we love having Stallions be innovative and come up with really neat ideas for our school to participate in. So excellent job you guys, we're so excited about it. Awesome. All right, have another opportunity out there and you may have heard about this from Ms. McAllister, but if you're an artist Ooh. and would like to be the person whose artwork is on the front cover of our yearbook this year, we have a chance for you. We're having a yearbook art contest, Ooh. and the theme is uh, Better Together because all of our differences make Southside an amazing place. True. So if you can come up with an idea about being better together and draw a picture of that, it can include words if you want. You have yep. to make sure those are spelled correctly, but it just needs to be on a normal sheet of paper this size. Nice. Eight and a half by 11. You can draw with... Um, crowns, markers, you can even print something, but if you do that, it needs to be your own work. You can't put other right. people's clip art and that kind of stuff in it. Right. But this is due 
next Friday. Okay. So if you're an artist, we'd like to see lots of submissions. That way we have a hard choice about who will be the cover. I can't wait to see what they come up with. I mean, that's going to be amazing. So, you know, today during announcements, two really important hobbies, artists and readers. Hopefully you can find something that interests you and really show us how you shine. So cannot wait to see what these regular white piece of paper, you know, pieces of paper get transformed into. All right, well, that is all we have for you guys today. So, of course, you know we love seeing you be here at Southside every single day. And we love to see you be safe, safe respectful, respectful, and responsible. And it's always a great day to be a Southside Stallion. Bye, guys. Bye.